Good afternoon, YouTube. This is Econ Kate 88, and I'm in St. Petersburg, Florida again. And I'm at this uh, condo complex called the Fusion near the Tampa Bay Ray Stadium. And there's a young couple there walking to uh, Chihuahuas. I guess that's kind of the demographic that they're looking for for this area. And unfortunately, probably some of the people that have moved into some of these apartments and lofts and stuff really have no idea where they are. This is kind of uh, an area that used to be Skid Row that was revitalized when they put the baseball stadium in here. In my previous video, I showed these uh, apartments and lofts. Let me get one more look at them here. The ground floor is definitely 100% empty. And as I said at the end of the last video, my guess is about 80% of the entire two building project is empty. So, when they built these, a lot of these other places. Uh, commercial spaces had been filled with businesses. You can see across the street there, there's one that's uh, for lease. I'm not sure what that used to be. And even the places that are open, there's a Grand Central Grill that really doesn't have anybody there. It's open though. Next door is a place called Leafy Green Cafe. Organic eatery, there isn't anybody there. Definitely kind of a cool structure, but uh, just some bad timing. The I don't see the economy here really recovering anytime soon. No matter how many baseball stadiums they build. Actually, somebody has spent quite a bit of money revitalizing these old buildings. It says this place here opens at uh, 11 o'clock in the morning. Organic eatery. I'd be surprised if they had a single customer here all day. There's not a, any cigarette butts out here or no, uh, really no sign of life. Sensational health and massage looks like they've gone out of business. This place here is also for lease. Upstairs is empty as well. Same over here on the other side. I'm not sure what this was, but there's two other businesses that have flopped. Looks like it was uh, the Joint Spinal Center, some chiropractor, and then uh, massage therapist. Pretty cool building. Kind of a little back patio there. It goes down into a, a small river or creek, more or less. Interesting place to have a massage place. Here's a much better look at the lofts, condos, apartments, whatever you want to call them. Again, you can see all the spaces for lease. And there's a few uh, few young folks over here, probably uh, young professionals that want to live downtown. Because they do have like a, a little area with a bunch of bars and stuff farther down on uh, Central, but here we're getting up towards, uh, as I mentioned, we're getting up more towards uh, the bad part of town. So it really doesn't matter how much government money gets spent, or how many big dreams folks have, the economy is trying to E-leverage. And that means, unfortunately, for these folks that have built these projects, they're in for a long wait. And a lot of them just aren't going to make it. So That's it for this one, actually. I'm going to start another one up here a little ways and... Uh, I think there's a couple more buildings up about 10 or 12 blocks up the street, but I don't want to make the videos too long. 
So that's it for this one.